fine Sunday afternoon for baseball at Petco Park. Today, the finale of this three-game weekend series between the Phillies and the San Diego Padres. Alongside Mark DeRosa and Dan Plesak, and guys, the Padres played well in the series so far, winning the first two in this three-game set. No doubt they will be absolutely focused. You want to steal a sweep from your rivals any chance you can. And I got to be honest, this is probably bigger for the fans than the players playing in this one. Huge bragging rights at stake. Hugh Darvish is on the mound for the Padres in this one. Dan, any thoughts? Hugh Darvish is what you look at when you're looking for an ace. Big, strong guy came over from Japan, 95 to 97 miles an hour, all the way back from Tommy John surgery. Has the curveball, the changeup, and the slider. Will throw any pitch at any count. One of the top pitchers in the game, and you'll know early if he's seeing. Here's Darvish on 0 and 2, lined to the right side, but this will yeah. not elude the right fielder. Next to hit, Joaquin Dias. He was hitless. In He's set. Here's the 2 2. And the slider gets him swinging. Two gone. It's always nice to keep a guy that has good wheels off base. And that's just what they did right there. Big strikeout. Keep that guy off the base path. Top of the first with nobody on. A shot to first base and caught there to end the inning. Zach Plezak will do the pitching in game three of the series. What's your take on him, Dan? Well, if that last name sounds familiar, yep, it rings a bell. That's my nephew, Zach Plezak, on the mound right now. Right-hander can do just about everything. Terrific fielding pitcher. Might have the best right-handed pickoff move to first and second base in the game. Fields his position four to 96 with a good curveball and a changeup, but his best secondary pitch right now is a straight changeup. Hit in the air down the right field line. Harper is there. One pitch, one out. Bases are empty, one man out. To third. And very quickly there, they're two gone to start the inning. Next up, Fernando Tatis Jr. No one aboard for him, and two gone here in the first. Now the pitch. Fastball swung on and grounded out towards second. He's right there. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Three up, three down for San Diego. We are still scoreless. The switch hitting Francisco Lindor and he's looking to turn things around ice cold at the plate in recent action. Oh and two here it comes got him. Really good late bite on that slider right there. The best ones have that late action that just darts at the last minute. They're so tough to get the bat on and when you've got that good slider going. Looked like the cut fastball there, and he got him to swing through it for the second out. Every pitcher looks to get off to a good start, and I'd say he's off to a good start. How about the first five batters he's faced? Three of them he sent down via the strikeout. Rowdy Tellez the next to bat. Hit in the air to center field. O'Grady is under this one, and that will retire the side. It ain't real if you ain't bust no one of the things he'll do, he'll open up that outside corner, especially with left-handed batters. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Dias has to roam straight back, but he has it for the first. Pulled toward right center field. Center fielder on the run. He gets there and makes the play. Nothing in two count and the pitch. Right side fair ball down the line. The throw into second. 
the tag and they'll get him at second and with that the side is retired Padres down in order will move to the third with no score brings up Javi Baez he's the number seven hitter but he's leading off the third after the first six guys in the lineup have been retired in order you can tell from their dugout this guy is carrying himself with a presence out on the mound he's got feel for all his pitches one away here to begin the third Next up is JT Real Muto. Head to head numbers. Line drive, base hit down the line. And this will find the wall deep in the corner. And he is in at second base with a one out double. Not really that much the pitcher can do about that one. He put the ball Zach. down in the zone where he wanted it, but it was just a solid piece of hitting goes down and gets it and pulls it into the corner for extra bases. Yeah as you know Dan sometimes the hitter just wins. Once again a three two. Now a ball lifted high in the air towards shallow right center field. O'Grady comes on now and makes the catch and O'Grady. He had a couple of hits in that ball game last night. Take a swing at it. On the ground to the left side. In time to first, and there are two away. Directy here with two away. And the pitcher bats next. That will be you, Darvish. Ready to deal. Here comes the first pitch. Hit on the ground to short. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Three up, three down for San Diego. They trail it here, two to nothing. Ready with another 2-2. Two -two. And he looks at a cold strike three as the cut fastball's in there, and that's out number one. And one. The next 3-2. And he looks at one that misses, and that's an excellent job of making his man throw a lot of pitches as he toughs out a walk. Well, the reason power hitters generally draw more walks than other guys is exactly what we saw right there. Pitchers work. Now the 0-1. Pitch is way outside, and that's straight to the backstop. But he's safe at first as he gets back in time. Hoping to send him packing. Pitch on its way. And a swing and a miss there on a late-breaking slider as he set down on strikes for the second time this afternoon. This pitching staff has done a really good job against this guy in this series. This is a really good hitter, and it's not easy to make a guy strike out five times in a series up to this point, but that's what they've done to this guy so far. Popped up. Garcia is there. And that retires the side. So it's no runs, no base hits, no errors. Play Tommy Pham. He set to lead us off in the hole. A swing and a ground ball to third. And a long throw across the diamond gets him. That's a nice play. And definitely worth another look with our show track data. Great reaction from the hot corner to make the backhand stop. And then he unleashes that very at the plate. Greg Garcia. He'll try to bunt his way on as he gets this one down. Uh, this gets foul. It's 0-1. He's over. And a swing and a miss as they got him with the slider there. Two away. Pretty textbook pitching right there. Jump ahead and account 0 2 and then start working outside the zone. Easier said than done, but that's the way you do it. Another one. No runs, just one hit. No errors in the ballgame for the Padres. Smoked on the ground, left side. That's through for a base hit, and he's one for two now. Tying run at the plate, the 0-1. Strike called, now the throw down. 
And he is out at second. Caught stealing to end the inning. Trying to move into scoring. He's set. Here it comes. Now a ball slapped hard the opposite way. A dive, but it's off his glove. Around first, he's digging for second. And he will coast into second with a leadoff double. Their own pitcher is absolutely dealing right now. So this is a big moment in this game. If his teammates can pick him up and drive him in now, that might be all they need to get the W here. Into the box, JT Real Muto. He offers at it and hits it in the air to left. Pham is right there as he puts it away. No problem for the first. From the stretch, here's the pitch. As he'll swing and pop this one up near second base. Garcia has to shade his eyes from the sun, but he's... The 1-0. Ground ball right side. And that is into right field, a base hit. He'll come home with it. To second now, but he's safe as a run will score on the play as well. A bouncer to the left side. Machado has to hurry. Throw in time, and the side is retired. And he's behind 0-2. This guy's been really on point so far, but it's not getting any easier. He has to get through 4, 5, and 6 right here. And he got him. Go. Eric Hosmer. Hosmer. Now the first pitch. Hit in the air to center field. Long run for the center fielder. He gets there, and that's the second out. Padres, Will Myers. First offering. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Stanton will reach out with one hand to make the catch on the move, and that ends the inning. Padres down in order. They trail it here three to nothing. Sixth about to get started. And coming forward, the veteran outfielder, Bryce Harper. A swing, and he pulls it down the line and deep. Myers going back. Gone. He uses that short porch to an advantage. Home run. A solo home run off the bat of Bryce Harper. And even 40 home runs on the year for him now as they move on top four to nothing. Boy, this guy just keeps going on. His 40th home run of the season, and he's not done yet. He keeps this up. He's definitely going to be in the conversation for some of the year-end awards. Jaime Maria will come on and make his fourth appearance in this campaign. Swing and a liner. But this is right at him in right field as he hardly has to move. Timing was on point. Just sometimes you have bad bat barrel accuracy. Got him. And he goes down on strikes for the third time. This has not been a weekend to remember for him. He's just been completely lost at the plate, flailing all over the place. Now that's his sixth strikeout of the series. They've really got him Into figured. the windup and the pitch. Pulled toward right center field. Center fielder on the run. He's there to track it down. Now it'll be Austin Nola. He'll start things out in the sixth for a lineup that really hasn't found its groove in this one. Here it comes. A bouncer to the left side. Baez with the bare hand. He's out. Ready now is Brian O'Grady. He bounced out last Not time. Not the greatest of game plans, though. The next 0-2. Gets him looking at the knees for the strikeout. Jake Cronenworth will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. I know that fastball registered at about 92-93, but I guarantee you it looked about four to five miles an hour faster than that. For this offense. Uh, we'll have to leave it there as the play is made for the third out. Three up, three down for San Diego. They're down four nothing. Dan Altavia is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Now the first pitch. Skied into straightaway right. Myers is under it. 
Makes the play one away. The payoff pitch one more time. There's ball four. Well, when you go with a slider there in a full count, you're hoping that the hitter is thinking fastball and swings through it. Didn't work out that way, though. He lays off and gets the free pass. Zach Plezak, 0 for 2 here to start the afternoon. Now a bunt attempt here. Oh, behind the back. Only plays to first, so the pitcher does his job as it's a successful sacrifice. Not much velocity on it. The game has changed. To the right side and through a base hit. And he can't come up with it cleanly here in right. And the run is in to score from second. Now a 5 nothing lead. Hey, guys, he's lucky he's getting this baseball back. He hung that middle of the plate. The batter's eyes lit up and he was able to put Goodwood on it. Swing and a miss as the slider sets him down for the final out of the inning. So one run on one hit, no errors, and a runner left. It is stretch. So now here is Tommy Pham. And at this point of the game, the windup and the 0-2 pitch. Line to shortstop, and there's one away. I like the idea of taking it and making the pitcher bring you something a little more hittable. Hit out towards second. Scooped up. Throw in time at first for route number the two. Seventh pitch coming up. Hit on the ground out to short. Reined in. Over to first, and that retires the side. Padres down in order. Need to get it going soon. It's 5-0. Ryan Tapera has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Next to dig in will be Bryce Harper. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. But, but they still have a chance, and when you have a chance, you have hope. And it's fouled away. And it wouldn't be a game in Southern California without the obligatory beach ball sighting as this one makes its way onto the field. Here comes the one two. Grounded back up the middle. Fielded cleanly. Throw on to first in time so the leadoff man is set down to open up. Grounded weakly to the right side. Scooped up. And there are two away now. Left side. Throw cleanly into first, and that ends the inning. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Hot shot to third and handled for the first out. Now batting. First. Hit out towards second. He's right there. And that's the second out. Sent on the ground out to second. Reined in. And eight innings have come and gone now as the inning is over. So they go down without a whimper here. Ninth inning coming up. The Phillies lead it five to nothing. Matt Barnes enters from the pen to start the ninth inning as he'll try to keep the score right where it is heading to the bottom of the ninth. Here now the 2-2. He is swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. Well, we'll see a lot of these power arms coming out of the bullpen in these days, but it doesn't make it any less impressive to me. I love watching guys come in and blow smoke right by guys. Swing and a ball hit out toward right center. Center fielder on the run. He tracks it down and makes the play to record the second out. Now the first pitch. As he sends it on the ground to first. Hosmer has it and he'll step on the bag himself and the inning is over. And next to hit is the catcher, Austin Nola. Oh, it's a ball and a strike. Popped up. Real Muto is under it. Looks it into his glove, and there's one gone. Box. Brian O'Grady. No hits oh, yeah. in two trips to the plate for him in the ball game. First offering on its way. 
Swing and a liner toward the gap in left center. And he will make the play out there, and there are two away now. San Diego down to their final strike. Hard hit toward center. But he will make the catch on the hard hit ball out there, and that will conclude matters here as this ball game is over. 5 0, the final score today. Philadelphia get their 30th win on the road so far this season. Zach Plezak gets to double digits with his 10th win of the year as he allows only two hits over nine full innings. So that will wrap things up for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our whole crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, head to the show.com.